<laughs> wow, this is crazy. Hello, my friends. How are you doing today? I want to show you the new image to 3D to image feature by Korea. Let's get started. So Korea is an online platform, not something you can use locally, but this is not a paid ad. I'm showing you this because it came out today and it's absolutely stunning. So let's get right into it. You have a lot of different tools here. Video generation, by the way, with your generation, you can use all of the different models, runway, cling, all of that. But we're not going to talk about that today. Today, we are going to talk about that feature. So first, I want to generate here the image of a car. So let's say luxury car on gray background. And also let's make it a red luxury car. Let's click here on generate. And this is the wrong ratio. So let's go here. Let's go with the 16 by 9 ratio. Click on generate and it is going to give us that luxury car in a chaffy. There we are already. How about how about this one or maybe this one? Um, let's take this one, for example. I like that one. So let's choose that. Let's click here on download. And then we can head over to real time generation because that is what that is. So let's click here. And as you can see here, two shapes, they are basic shapes. You can simply remove them like that. Click on them. On the left side, you have the lead here. And we have a like a forest in the background creates a forest on the right side. So what you can do here is you can replace the background. So down here you have the canvas background. You click on that. You can either use colors or photos which are provided. You can also have textures or illustrations. You can also put your own background. So in this case, let's, for example, use this background here because it has kind of like a road in here. And then I'm also going to drag my image into that canvas from my desktop. There we have the image. I made myself a little bit smaller so you can see everything that's going on. Let's make this big and then I will right click here and say remove background. So you can see like a lot of tools are brought here together for your convenience. This takes a little bit and there the background is removed. Now we right click again and say convert to 3D and this should now turn it into a simple textured 3D shape that we can use to pose this car in any way we want and make all kinds of crazy prompts with that you will see in a second. You can see the conversion is going actually pretty fast. We are almost done. Let me talk a little bit more. Bam, 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 bam. And there we go. Are we ready? Yes, we have a 3D shape. There it is. Let's delete the image here. As you can see here now, we have the car as a 3D shape and already on the right side, it's trying to create that. But I also have to put that into the prompt. So let me write here um, a luxury car, a red luxury car in a forest. And look at like this is crazy. Look at how good that looks right away. But the interesting thing here is when I now rotate the car, it will, of course, also recreate that on the other side and it will also adjust the complete scene to that. You can see. So, for example, it changed the road so it fits my image. I can, of course, also make the car bigger. So whatever kind of scene you want to design here, this can follow you with that and just create it in any way you want to fit specifically the kind of composition, the kind of design you need for your project. And of course, you can change the prompt. So for example, let's say here we want to have a winter forest and then it takes a little bit and bam, we have a winter forest. Look at the details on the car. Look at the details of the forest. That is pretty amazing. But if you thought, well, OK, it's a forest in a car, it creates a forest in a car. That is not everything it's doing. So let's, for example, go here and say at a beach, dramatic sky at night. Look at that. Wow. And by the way, let's say tropical beach, tropical beach. And there we go. <laughs> we have the car parked at a tropical beach. Look at that. It's readjusting. You can, by the way, also like move this area to up here if you want to, if it's in the way. So you can like design this in any way 
you see fit have full control over that process as you can see that is just amazing and of course you can also like paint in here you can add new shapes for example um, let's add here a shape like a circle let's put it like this and then we can also change the color there we go we can change the color of that let's make it more yellow and there we go it's already turning into a moon how crazy is that how crazy is that so there we go up here all oh, with clouds beautiful beautiful um yeah it's, it's a full moon night it's just it just like figured it out that we want to have a full moon night and you can put the moon like anywhere you want maybe we want to put the moon back here and then wow okay <laughs> I can bring it actually I can send it backwards behind the car so it's like this damn how good is that how easy is that how fast is that I'm like I, I know I, I sound like an advertisement it really is not I'm just talking about my I, I'm like super impressed by this because it's so it's so like fast and I have to tell you I'm right now in Bangkok I have a laptop with a 2080 so I couldn't run this actually but uh, because this is all online I can do that I have here a little pocket modem with me that's it that's all I need it's a it's a slow connection but this is good enough to do all of that and um, I can I can still like readjust here the color of the moon if I say hey that's a little bit too red there we go and we didn't even use a beach background and like I said you can still you can rotate the car like this is so amazing I'm gonna show this to a friend of mine he has an advertisement agency and also makes like anime movies and this tool wow that's really cutting down on, on production processes how crazy how crazy is that I'm absolutely stunned by that I want to play around with that for the rest of the night because it's just I don't know what to tell you my mind is blown so this is super crazy let me know in the comments what you think about that and thanks for watching see you soon bye